What's good, YouTube? It's your boy P Money. So, Tyson Fury's A sample has had some issues, according to many insiders. So, the plot thickens on this whole Deontay Wilder versus Tyson Fury 2 fight. And it's looking like Tyson Fury not only tampered with his gloves, but he also was on some performance enhancers to <clears throat> help him defeat Deontay Wilder. So it's just looking more and more like all the, the work that Tyson Fury put in, you know what I mean, to get the, the championship was all for naught because he wasn't man enough to fight this man, man to man, you know, fair and square, because he probably was fearful of Deontay Wilder. It just was weird to me how he just had like this sudden boost of confidence going off, like going into this fight. The first fight he was very like scared looking, but this one he wasn't, I was just, it was just weird. Just I remember how his dad was like, they knew what it was, but then all of a sudden they're talking knockouts and all types of crazy stuff. So <laughs> it was just weird on the lead up, but I didn't want to say nothing at the time, of course, because I just like to watch how things transpire because you can feel that way, but still get your ass knocked out. But just after all this that I've seen, the whole glove situation, it's just a bad look for Tyson Fury all the way around. It's a bad look for his team. It's a bad look for everybody that, that's around Tyson Fury. And I just hope that they figure some shit out to either give Deontay Wilder his belts back or change it to a no contest. You know what I mean? Because it's not looking good for Tyson Fury. They're just awaiting the B sample right now. Once that comes back, which that's gonna also have some adverse findings. So it's only a matter of time before more stuff comes out about Tyson Fury. So all these little trolls bigging up Fury, you guys are a disgrace, man. You know what I'm saying? You guys are the type of dudes that you know, you see it in your face that this man cheated and you're just gonna sweep, sweep it under the rug because he beat, he beat Deontay Wilder. It doesn't matter how he won. It doesn't matter that his glove was loosed in the mug, flapping around. It doesn't matter that he was on performance enhancers, which makes a lot of sense. I bet you he was on them. Like once, that, once he went in that stint to the WWE, because we already know if you're a wrestling fan of any sort, you know that all them dudes is on roids like a mug. So that was like his way <laughs> to cycle on to some sort of PED, get away from boxing, come back. You know what I'm saying? I just think that against Otto Wallen, he was off of him. But in this fight right here, he was on him. Because against Wallen, he couldn't even he couldn't even hurt that man. Not really. Wallen just kept coming forward. And I know the champ has more power than Otto Wallen. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So this man cheated, man. I don't like it. I hate people that have to stoop to that type of level in a sport that's already dangerous to begin with. You know what I'm saying? And this is why a lot of fans don't be rocking with boxing like that stuff like this and they just try to sweep it under the rug big companies like fox and espn aren't even speaking on it at all they're just letting it be which is bs in my opinion like you can't be doing that to no fighter man you just can't do it and then he's the american <laughs> tyson fury is a foreigner they always be talking about all these different countries and whatnot but yet whenever it comes to boxing 
all that stuff goes out the window, you know what I'm saying? Because it's just what it's always about, just race, black versus white, you know what I mean? Like, sad, man. Like, if Tyson Fury would have beat the champ fair and square, I would be giving Tyson Fury mad props right now, man. Real shit. But I just can't look over all this all this mountain of evidence and just turn the other cheek and say, oh, the refs and the commission and all this stuff should have did this or did that. No, Tyson Fury should have came like a man and came correct. If he, if he could win fair and square, cool. If he... If he lost, it is what it is. At least I would give him mad respect for going in there like a man and then losing. You know what I'm saying? But no, he had to cheat, and I can't. I can't rock with that. Like that's not cool in my book. But this is your boy P Money. Make sure you guys like, comment, share, and subscribe. Shouts out to the entire LDBC. Shouts out to all my supporters. I appreciate you and every one of y'all. And I'm off this.